about to show you some videos. And I need you to ask yourselves, as you watch these videos, whether or not these individuals should be banned from society, banished. Maybe Siberia, John Iderola has proposed other places like Mordor. You can make that decision. But the real question is, the core issue here is, should these people be banned? I give you exhibit A. All right, it's toilet, toilet seat in the dishwasher. That is what we're watching. Someone made the decision to put a toilet seat in the dishwasher for washing. John, dirty, dirty things happen on a toilet seat. Uh, I grant you that. <laughs> Maybe not putting what that toilet seat in a situation where utensils we put in our mouths also exist. You know what I'm saying? I I get it. And I'm not do gonna do it. Do you? Do I, you get it, John? Do I you get, get it? Get what you're saying. Um, my dishwasher doesn't work, and I'm never, ever, ever gonna get around to fixing it. I've resigned myself to that. But even if it did exist, I wouldn't do this. But I think we have to have faith that if you put something in the dishwasher, no. there's so much hot water and soap that just everything is all right at the end. I think I, we we like if that wasn't the case, then. You put old crusty dishes in there that have got stuff that might have bacteria. You assume that that's killed by the no, dishwasher. Why I not? Don't the do that. I'm one of the weirdos <laughs> who practically cleans the dishes before putting them in a dishwasher so they can be mm -hmm. cleaned again. Like I put mine not in a kiln for six <laughs> hours before I put them in the dishwasher. <laughs> Nothing will survive. Okay, look, I'm going to be self-deprecating, I guess, for a moment, right? Because for those who might feel like it's offensive to be as critical as I am toward those weirdos who decided to put a toilet seat in the dishwasher, and mm -hmm. despite the fact that I think they should be banned from society, I too do things that others might think are gro is gross, right? Like I remember having a big debate in the office once over the fact that I don't think it's gross to share a bowl with your dog. Like, so a human bowl, let's say I put water in the bowl for my dog, and then later I obviously wash it. Oh. Okay. And then use it later. Is that gross? Yeah, I don't I don't think you need Some to do that. Gross. I mean, you could have two bowls. I mean, but but if no, I, if you're washing I it like I thought you were talking about like I have some cereal and he comes over and eats some of the cereal. <laughs> like what's the difference? No, if you're washing it, that's fine. Again, but why is that okay? It's okay because you assume that when you wash something, it kills the bacteria. So why not with the toilet seat? No, I think it's okay because in my mind, even if the bowl is not perfectly clean and some of my dog's mouth bacteria is still on it, mm -hmm. I just think like- Of which there's a lot. That. That's kind of nasty. <laughs> I don't care. Okay, so <laughs> nasty toilet seat gets taken off, put in a dishwasher, mm -hmm. run through on pots and pans. I'll give you pots and pans. Oh. And then I make a delicious sandwich and put it on the toilet seat. How much do I have to pay you to eat that sandwich? Nice absorbent oh. white bread. Get, throw some numbers out, out at me. $150. No. No? Why? You could buy so many more sandwiches with that. $1,000. Yes. Yeah, I would do it for $1,000. Okay, so you're yeah. irrational, but not that irrational. I know that I'm not going to get sick and I'm not going to die, but I'm going to be disgusted. And I mm -hmm. don't look dishwashers. People are going to get on me about this, but I'm, I'm just going to say it. Dishwashers aren't good. They're not that good. They're just not that good. They're not winning with dishwashers. No, like I don't Sometimes think dishwashers are great two, at cleaning three. dishes. I think that they do the bare minimum. Oftentimes there's still food residue on it. And that's even after I do a good job in like rinsing the dishes before putting it in the dishwasher. That's why putting the toilet seat in the dishwasher is disgusting because I don't believe for a second that it cleans everything that needs to be cleaned. And so also, assuming... let's also... There are factors that we're not taking into account. So we're looking at that, and that appears to be a relatively clean toilet seat already. But there are some people who have issues, right? Maybe irritable, irritable bowel syndrome, that kind of stuff. And there might be a lot more material involved, if you know what I mean. So 
It's just wrong. We shouldn't do it. Don't do it. That cross contamination is so unnecessary. I'm so worried now about this person that you're speculating that is like leaving caked on material on their toilet seat or whatever. But anyway, I I would put this in the category of like how people get really disgusted if there's a hair in something. It's not actually that bad, but we've decided to be disgusted by it. I think that's what it is. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I I think it's disgusting. Uh, so we do have a poll on this on our Twitch no, in no. our Twitch community. Should these people be banned from society? And 68% of our Twitch audience who participated in this poll said, hell yeah. 32% said no. 32% too high, a little mm -hmm. too high, but I think there, there we are. I'm okay with these results because I don't think there are many people that do this. <laughs> I think it's going to be okay. We have one more example, okay? Mm -hmm. So again, ask yourselves as we watch this video, and I have not seen this video yet, should the individuals involved be banned from society? Let's watch. Oh, hmm. That appears to be a fun game of some sort. Mm, no, girl, you got to... Gotta st you gotta be a little more steady when you're trying to play this game, I guess. No, no, not banned from society. I think that's fun. I think they're having a good time. Mm -hmm. What about you, John? You seem a little judgmental. I think I might be more familiar with a wider variety of games that would leave me not needing to come up with the hanging sausage toilet paper game. I like that it's innovative. <laughs> I think that we need people who think outside of the bathroom when it comes to games, but I... I'll play Carcassonne. I'll play Catan. I don't care. I'll play Blood Rage. I have lots of games I can play. I don't have to dangle that, a sausage. That game seems more fun to me than Cornhole. I'm just going to put it and, out there. And thematically related. By the way, uh, if you're just interested in dangling sausage, there are way more fun games to play. It doesn't oh, have to I'm be interested toilet in paper dangling thing. sausage. <laughs> <laughs> no, right. no ban, though. They can stay, right, no but ban. I'm going to keep my eye on them. I agree. I agree. I, I would not banish them. And you, there's no way you'd be allowed to banish them when you were unwilling to banish the toilet seat in the dishwasher guy. Ugh. So <laughs> dishwash that that sausage afterward, the way it's being slung <laughs> about all willy nilly.